Hello guys, today we'll analyze one stock from the packaging sector and the name of the stock is Moltec Packaging. When we go to the website of the company, in the product section we can see that they have packaging solution for ice cream, ghee, oil, dairy products, pasta and many more things. One thing which I liked about this company is that they have packaging for almost all types of product be it biryani, jam, sweets, coffee, energy drink, chocolate spread, various sizes ranging from 50 ml to 17 liters or 15 kg. Along with it they have many shapes available like round shape, oval shape, square, twist, rectangular. So they have packaging solution for almost all types of edible items be it liquid. Another solid point about the company is that it is the market leader in rigid plastic packaging. Now guys if you want to learn more about packaging you can watch my video on Uflex stock and even Polyplex stock. Another good thing about company is that they have 10 manufacturing facilities over the country so they have good geographic presence. They have 100% backward integration which means they are also manufacturing their molds and robots. They have their own raw material which drastically reduces the cost and is beneficial for the company in the long term. It gives the company the competitive edge over the other companies in the industry. When we have a look at the major clients of the company, we can see it has clients like Quality Walls, Hudson, Dabur, Adani Wilmer, Nescafe, even ITC, Nestle, Baskin Robbins, PNG, Haldiram, Amul. Hindustan Unilever Imami. This shows that company is catering to such a large sector. Now due to pandemic, there is increased demand for packaging products and this company has focused well on that. They are doing 100% free human contact packaging and they are the pioneers in the IML packaging. It is the first and the only company focusing on IML packaging which is in mold labeling where there are two QR codes and one on the outer side, one on the inner side and actual consumers can scan the inner QR code to claim rewards. Company is also focusing on innovations. They have come up with packaging which has inbuilt spoon, concept lid or on the go coffee containers. Having a look at the fundamentals of the stock, the market cap of the company is around 1400 crores. The current price of the stock is 493. Dividend yield is decent of 1.42 percentage. It has generated 78 percent returns in the last one year. When we have a look at the PE ratio of the stock, it is 24. The industry PE is also similar 23. So we can say that PE ratio of the company is in line with the industry. While book value is 85, when we have a look at the returns ratios, we can see return on capital employed is 22% and return on equity is also 22%. So returns are quite good. Debt to equity ratio is 0.45. So company has some amount of debt. In the PNL statement, we can see that sales of the company are improving every year and there is not even a single year in which sales of the company dropped in the last five years. So this is yet another positive for the company. Even the operating profit are increasing as well as the operating profit margin. So these are quite positives for the company. EPS of the share has improved from 8 and these to 20 in the last five years. Even company is increasing its dividend payout ratio having a look at the balance sheet we can see that company has sufficient amount of reserves main thing is that company is spending a lot on fixed assets and we can see that expenditure on fixed assets are also increasing every year so this can prove to be very beneficial in the long term if we look at the shareholding pattern we can see that promoters holding is around 35 percentage foreign institutions have 8 percentage foreign institutions have slightly reduced their shareholding if we compare with the previous quarter domestic institutions although have increased their shareholding and they are holding around 14 percentage public have 42 percentage but there is one special person who also has holding in this company 
and that person is Mr. Ashish Kacholia. He has 9,47,000 shares in this company contributing to 46 crores amount and it is 3.3% of his total portfolio and he has almost maintained the same position in the last few quarters. Ashish sir is well known for picking up small multi-bagger stocks but guys we cannot just invest looking at superstar investors we have to do our own research and if we like the company then we can think of investing at the right time looking at the charts and the fundamentals of the stock. So guys this is the chart of Moltec packaging on a one day time frame. Now I can see one support for the stock at the level of 465. So if somebody wants to invest in this stock I think they should wait for the stock to come at this level. While if somebody is already invested in this stock I think they can continue being invested and if they want to place an SL I think they can place an SL below the level of 450 somewhere at 449 or at the level of 450. On a weekly time frame also guys we can see that stock has taken support multiple times at the le level of 465 while on the upper side we can expect a resistance for this stock at the level of 500 and if stock manages to cross this resistance then second resistance could be at the level of 540. So guys if I missed any important point about the company or if you want me to cover any specific stock then you can let me know in the comment section below. Also please do not forget to like the video and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thank you.